Well, obviously, I think we've touched on a subject that is uh, very complex, and um, there are more meanings to um, stigma and um, more sources for it than we can touch on uh, in this conversation. I, I think it's important to reflect that, uh, that discrimination is a big, a big part of it, but I'm not so concerned about what we call it, um, discrimination, uh, stigma, bias, prejudice. Um, I, I think that there are distinctive reasons why, um, why individuals with mental illness are uh, by, uh, treated with, uh, with such bias. We, there are no other illnesses that manifest themselves behaviorally. I mean, there are actually occasional neurologic illnesses that, that do, but by and large, there's nothing um, that manifests itself through our behavior. And behavior, we see the person's behavior, we experience the person and we hold people accountable for their behaviors. And we've probably all heard um, the joke, it might, may have been a New Yorker cartoon about the um, one session brief uh, dynamic psychotherapy which consists of, snap out of it. <laughs> <laughs> we expect people to be able to change their behavior and um, if they can't, we hold them accountable in a way that we would never dream of holding some account, somebody accountable for developing cancer or for developing asthma. Uh, 